It's a meeting that a young tennis fan could only dream of. Mm, everything fine? How was it? Good. I'm fine. Nothing? No. Good. But it'll be a lasting memory. You know that I am a dangerous player now. <laughs> Rafael Nadal and 13-year-old ball kid Anita Birchall with her family along for the ride following an unbelievable evening. Wow. Playing on Rod Laver Arena, the Spaniard's Aaron Forehand struck Anita in the face. Forever a gentleman, he immediately eased the pain. Rafa. Well, that's a great moment. That kiss and today's catch-up, quite the remedy. Extremely nervous and at the same time I was extremely excited because I had finally gotten to meet my favourite tennis player, like, really close up. Watching at home in Templestowe, Mum Olga. I popped out to the toilet, um, as you do, and by the time I came out, my phone was buzzing with people telling me that she'd been kissed by Rafa. Um, I thought it was a joke initially. The world number one, easing her worry. Just the fact, like, as a mum, he lifted up her hat. I was able to see her face. She was all right. For these 15 special minutes, Rafa held court. And then he gave me this hat which says, to my friend Anita, all the best. Along with a selfie that's also been shared worldwide, Anita's moment proves meeting your heroes isn't such a bad thing after all. I was not disappointed. <laughs> He's a very nice man and he was, like, exactly what I imagined and more. Brayden Ingram, Nine News. You couldn't write about this, an incredible 24 hours for now, one of the world's most famous ball kids, Anita Birchall. This afternoon, she was back here at Melbourne Park on her day off meeting Rafael Nadal, who personally took time out to again apologise and make sure she was OK, presenting Anita with some memorabilia. Last night, Rafael Nadal, one of the world's most famous sports people, hit her in the head accidentally with a tennis ball, checked on her and gave her a kiss for good measure. Her mum and Anita didn't have any problem with it today. They're absolutely wrapped to meet Rafa again. One night I was just going to bed and then the next morning I woke up and suddenly everyone knows me. Well, I was very touched by his kindness and yeah, it was quite amazing. I think we both thought that that was very sweet. I think um, it was just a really kind and caring thing to do. And I think as a mum, I wasn't on court, but it was really nice. He lifted up her hat and he had a look that she was all right and then he gave her a sweet kiss. It was absolutely innocent and a lovely gesture that we both appreciated.